Uh, we have St. Leo coming for a three-game series. What are some of your thoughts on them? Yeah, you know, coming off of uh, last weekend, um, you know, first of all, I thought we uh, we played with some some real toughness on the road with uh, a couple come from behind wins against against Florida Southern, and uh, we got contributions from from a lot of people over the weekend. So uh, as we as we kick into St. Leo, always a tough opponent. Um, Similar in style of play, they're very aggressive, they're very good defensively, they put a premium on that, as do we, uh, good pitching. So, um, you know, top 20 team, uh, you know, been one of the benchmark programs in the conference since I've been in, since uh, 2015, and uh, excited for a, a really good conference weekend. We have a lot of events going on. We got Amber Jack Night Friday, Macy Senior Day Saturday. Uh, what are some of your thoughts of those two elite pitchers in program? Yeah, so uh, you know, kind of worked out that way. You know, Amber going into the Wall of Honor um, last month or two months ago. Now in January, as time flies here, um, you know, she just had a, a hell of a career. You know, when I was kind of putting her script together, you know, fifty shutouts in a career, uh, you know, just under eight hundred strikeouts for a career, World Series appearance, you know, South Region Pitcher of the Year, Conference Pitcher of the Year, left-handed. So, uh, you know, maybe she's got a couple innings for us uh, tonight. But um, and and also Amber uh, did a great job as an assistant coach here as well, uh, assistant coach Penner for for a number of years. So always great to to have our our legends back. Uh, and then Mason you know honoring what what really uh, for us was a, was a turning point in our program getting uh, Macy to come um, you know before she got here uh, you know even for the couple years before I got here and then my first two years we had you know statistically the worst pitching in the conference and uh, you know her her arrival signaled that was no longer going to be the case and you know last year statistically we had one of the best staffs not only in the conference but in the country and uh, she's a, she's a big reason why so um, obviously a lot still left left to accomplish with Mace here this season, but, you know, um, always good to take some time out to, to reflect back. And, uh, you know, again, that's, uh, it'll be, you know, regardless of, of, of if we, you know, meet our goals this year, when, when we get to where we want to get to, you know, whether Macy's here or not, she'll be a big reason why, um, you know, we, we, we get to a high level, her arrival. Yeah, what do we have to do to get some victories this weekend? Yeah, I mean, we just uh, we have to play well. Um, you know, limit limit mistakes, and that's that's physical mistakes, that's mental mistakes, that's emotional mistakes, and even then, it's softball. So whoever who, you know, we can do all those things, and um, you know, whoever's going to play the best is is ultimately going to going to win the series. And um, you know, so we're just excited to to get out and uh, and, and get after it.